afternoon everybody hello it is thursday i've just had the tesco grocery shopping delivery i've also been and got some bits from sainsbury's so most of it is tesco's but there is a few of sainsbury's bits in there so i'm going to take you through and show you what i've got and just kind of give you some some sort of idea of what meals we're gonna be doing so here goes okay we're gonna start over here first of all i've got some kitchen towels some floor wipes i've also got two boxes of tissues some kitchen roll which i got from sainsbury's because i actually forgot that i'd put a four pack of kitchen roll in the tesco delivery so i've got kitchen rolls coming out of my bum so that's okay um, i've got some laundry cleanser cotton wool pads I've got some Dettol washing machine cleaner I like to do that every several weeks I've got new toothbrushes for the kids I've got a couple of these coconut feeders because I like to put those out for the birds all year round I've got some kids toothpaste um, some Bapanthan nappy cream I've uh, also got some comfort fabric softener I've got some bold two-in-one laundry gel I've got this uh, Zoflora. I didn't realise they were actually the festive limited edition, but um, it's winter morning one and festive fireside, so I'm not sure what they're going to smell like, but that's okay. Zoflora, Zoflora, it's only to put down the sink and stuff. Then I've got some Method All Floor Cleaner to do the floors. I've got some of these Tesco Zone in wash fragrance booster pearls i've got two lots of those and i don't know if i said washing up liquid i also got some uh during the week i think it was or last week and i forgot and put some more on the tesco delivery so again we've got washing up liquid coming out of our bums so that's that for sort of like the laundry and cleaning cupboard kind of thing over here we've got four packs of the tesco's own fred and flow nappies now onto the snack cupboard stuff. I've got some Tesco's own prawn cocktail shells. I've got some tortilla chips because me, Neil, and the kids all like these kind of things. So uh, I've got some cheese puffs, Tesco's own ones. I've got two lots of Walker's crisps. Then I've got a box of matchmakers, guilty pleasure, right there. Um, a packet of Cadbury's whisper bars. Packet of Kit Kat chunkies, packet of Twix fingers. Uh, I've got some milk chocolate buttons and some white chocolate buttons. I've got a box of Ritz biscuits for the kids, some chocolate digestive cookies. Uh, I've got. I did get a box of mini gingerbread men from Sainsbury's because the kids wanted something to snack on, so I got those. I got some white sub rolls for hot dogs, and I've got two packs of large marshmallows because Mealy likes to snack on those and then I've got all of these Ella's Kitchen fruits I've got mangoes bananas apples and pears and excuse the mess with all the carrier bags and stuff those ones are ripped we do actually reuse the carrier bags but those ones rip because labels and stuff on them um, and then in here I've got my one of my favorite bags ever is my Starbucks macchiato and latte drinks so I've got a whole bag of those I think there's five macchiatos and four of the normal ones so i also got a hobis best of both medium slice loaf that's to go in the freezer because we've already got some bread out for the tins and uh, drinks i got um, a pack of cherry coke and two packs of these to these fridge packs of normal coca-colas and then i got dolmio original bolognese sauce tin of hot dogs a three pack of Heinz baked beans, two packs of this Tesco batter mix because I like to have pancakes sometimes, a four pack of these I chicken and mushroom pot noodles, a pack of beef stock cubes, some organic tomato ketchup, got some chunky salsa sauce, got two jars of pickled onions because I like those, just because I do, a pack of sage and onion stuffing, a four pack of green giant sweet corn and i got a fajita kit i also got some cooking oil and another one of the most important things is some yellowtail jammy red roux south australian red wine delicious okay fruit and veg um i got some carrots fresh carrots stump this over here uh, three pack of red onions 
Uh, we've got a pack of garlic, or it's one large garlic. We've got a pack of parsnips. A pack of Brussels sprouts. I love them. Uh, two courgettes. Um, some bananas. Uh, got red pepper. That's to go with them for fajitas. Um, a pack of British jacket potatoes. Um, I've got a few sweet potatoes in there. I've got some frozen baby carrots because I forgot to get it on the Tesco shopping, so I got it at Sainsbury's instead. And I've got a large pack of McCain French fries. And I've got two packs of baby corns. A pack of close cut mushrooms. And a punnet of red seedless grapes. On a side note, I just found the soured fresh cream to go with the fajita kit and the salsa. Then over here, I got some Cravendale milk, semi skimmed milk. I got two four pinters of those. I've um, got some Tesco finest coleslaw. I'm running out of room here. Everything's going to fall down. I've got some wafer thin roast chicken to go with Neil's lunches. Some flora buttery spread. Some. Belgian chocolate eclairs. I got two boxes of six Happy Egg Company eggs. And then I got two lots of deep filled flat garlic breads. Um, I thought I was actually getting different Yorkshire puddings, but it doesn't matter that they're gluten and wheat free, it's probably better for you. So I got two lots of those. I got a cheese medley pizza, Chicago Town one. Yummy. I got a pack of Richmond thick pork sausages. I got one pack of steak slices and one pack of chicken and mushroom slices. Then I got two of these vegetable and haricot bean cobblers. I thought they sounded quite nice. Um, then for fresh meat, I got two packs of these two chicken breast portions. Oh, I forgot about the young scampi, which I got. I know Neil likes scampi, and I quite like it sometimes. Then I got two packs of these Willow Farm chicken mini fillets, so I can cut them up and we can do them for different meals. Then I've got two packs of the diced chicken breast. So I'll probably do a chicken stew and maybe a chicken korma. One of those can be used for, for that at some point. I got a pack of four breaded chicken steaks I'm going to divide them up so it's basically going to be two lots of two so there will be one each for me and Neil and that will be two meals so that's quite handy and I got two packs of the steak mince 500 gram packs I'm going to split each pack into two so that's literally the equivalent of four meals because the kids don't really eat meat stuff so it's literally just me and Neil the kids will have vegetables and things like that instead and here I got a cottage pie. And last but not least, I think, I believe, I got a carbonara, carbonara pasta bake. So that is it for all the food shopping. It is literally crazy. This will probably last us about two weeks, maybe two and a bit weeks. Um, I mean, obviously the cleaning stuff, where it's going to last a bit longer. But, yeah, in terms of meals and stuff, the snacks I'm always having to stock up. The fruit I'm always having to stock up. So, yeah, um, half of it, I would say, is going to last us probably about two and a bit weeks, um, which will be all of this stuff mainly here. And obviously the cupboard stuff over here. But, yeah, that is it for our Tesco grocery haul. It's our bulk shop done. So that is it for the grocery haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Just getting a sneak peek into our food cupboards and our fridges and freezers. Um, I know I absolutely love grocery haul videos. I'm just kind of nosy like that. Please like and subscribe and make sure you come back and check out some more videos.
so that's it for this grocery haul video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.